Right, the Financial Sector Conduct Authority is concerned about the billions in unclaimed pension funds. It's a lot of money. There are around 4.5 million beneficiaries who haven't claimed. Uh, let's find out how this has happened and what we can do to try and get people their money. Takalani Lukai Maane uh, from the Financial Sector Conduct Authority uh, joining us. Hello to you, Takalani. It's a lot of money not to have been claimed. What's going on? Indeed, it is a lot of money, and thank you for the opportunity to address the issue. Um, unfortunately, there are people, in, in the majority of cases, historical um, individuals um, or people who left um, their pensions um, from 1970, 1980s, 1990s, um, that did not claim their money when they left, um, and due to various reasons. Um, and unfortunately, it's been difficult to try and trace and pay them because of inaccurate data or outdated um, contact details. And so we have this 44 billion mm. um, that is outstanding payments um, from Provident and pension funds. Um, in South Africa. So this sounds like this goes back quite a few decades. I would imagine at this point a lot of those people could have perhaps left the formal working sector. They've gone into retirement. Sadly, I'm sure some may have even passed on. So if someone is watching now and they suspect a family member could have had some kind of money sitting mm. uh, in a pension fund, a retirement annuity, whatever it is, what can they do? Where do they need to go? What's their first step, Takalani? So we recognize that um, a lot of people wouldn't know where to start. And hence, we asked all retirement funds um, to provide us with their unclaimed benefit data. So the FSCA doesn't actually hold the money. The money is held with um, the retirement funds in our industry. And odd 1,300 um, retirement funds have got uh, spread across them, there's 4.5 million beneficiaries. Um, and so we asked them to give us all of that data. And with that, we created a, a database or a search engine that we host on our website. Um, and so we would encourage people, um, if they suspect for themselves or for um, a family member um, who has subsequently um, um, is now deceased um, and had not claimed, or they're not even sure whether the person had claimed or not, mm. um, to up to you database um, to at least have a starting point to determine whether there is a possible unclaimed benefit for them or not. Um, they could also make an inquiry with our office um, if they, they don't want to use the search engine. There are quite a few um, platforms that they could use to access that database as well. So there, anyone watching now going, this sounds great, Takalani, are they looking for uh, the FSCA? Is there a website address you can give me quickly? Yes, um, sorry, they're looking for www.fsca.ca.za. Um, we've got a toll free number 0800 230 722. Um, they could also use uh, an SMS line where they could SMS their ID, then it will automatically check in our search engine. Um, that number is 30913. Um, and obviously, then they could just always call our offices on 012. 428-8000, um, and they will get assistance from us. We've got a dedicated team um, that works together with the administrators and the retirement funds um, to assist members mm. of the public um, in meeting their unclaimed benefits. Uh, I'm going to repeat that number very quickly, 0800-230-722. Hope I got that right. And the website again, www.fsca. Was it .co.za? Was that the rest of it? Yes, it is. Okay. .co.za. All right, very briefly, before I let you go, last minute or so, Takalani, uh, what happens to the money if it doesn't get claimed by anybody, family members, uh, beneficiaries? What happens to all this money? It's almost 44.9 uh, billion rand. Yes. Um, so at the moment, there is uh, that money belongs to, um, if it was allocated to me as Takalani, it belongs to me um, uh, in perpetuity. There is a, an, a proposal to have a central unclaimed benefit fund where, um, whereas now there's only just the data in one place, then the money and the data will be in one place. So people don't have to go to 1,300 odd funds to try and find the money. Um, but the money, then that fund, that structure will then be tasked with still trying to trace and pay those individuals. If at some point in this 
is a very big if at some point. 30, 50 years down the line, they still haven't found that person and they tried absolutely everything, then um, they will have to look at whether they could use that money for mm. any right. social good in terms of school. All right, Takalani, it looks like I'm else. just starting to lose they you would, at the end travel. there. But Takalani, I'm sorry, I'm sorry to lose you just at the end there. Uh, the line is dropping, so I think it's a good time to say thank you and goodbye for the moment. Uh, great to talk to you. Takalani Lukhamane from the Financial Sector Conduct Authority. Let me repeat the number quickly, 0800 230 722 or www.fsca.co.za. So unclaimed pension money going back decades. If you suspect you or a loved one could have pension money sitting around, it's yours. You've just got to go claim it uh, on that fsca.co.za.